We make daily U.S. immigration update videos to make your U.S. journey easy. Watch the full video to know all the updates. The Bipartisan Dignity Act spearheaded by Maria Elvira Salazar and Veronica Escobar has made significant progress in the House of Representatives. This historic immigration bill is the only legislation in Congress that addresses all the pressing challenges within our nation's immigration system. It has garnered bipartisan backing and is steadily advancing and building support. Salazar said, I am heartened by the enthusiasm and dedication demonstrated by my colleagues in advancing the Dignity Act. Republicans and Democrats are working to uphold the dignity of individuals, while securing our borders and ensuring a prosperous future for our nation. They represent a broad and diverse group of states and territories, including Florida, Texas, New York, California, Michigan, Oregon, Pennsylvania, North Carolina, Nevada, and Puerto Rico. Dozens of prominent stakeholders have weighed in, including support from across the business sector, immigration groups, the agricultural community, the faith community, educators, economic experts, community leaders, ambassadors, and United States senators. Salazar will continue working in Congress to advance this critical bill. National Stakeholders The Dignity Act represents one of the best good-faith efforts toward comprehensive immigration reform that we have seen in years. This legislation takes into account the intrinsic dignity of undocumented immigrants, offers functional legal mechanisms for immigration, and respects due process and secure borders. We appreciate U.S. Reps. Salazar and Escobar, along with a bipartisan group of members, for including meaningful agricultural labor reform provisions in their reintroduction of the Dignity Act. The domestic labor shortage remains one of agriculture's greatest challenges, impacting farmers today and jeopardizing the future of American agriculture. Congress must address this workforce crisis threatening farms across the U.S. so our producers can continue to grow, feed, clothe and fuel our nation. We applaud these lawmakers for their willingness to work across the aisle and taking this step toward fixing a system that for far too long has not been effective and efficient in tackling the needs of our nation. We urge their colleagues in the House and Senate and the Biden administration to engage with the solutions proposed in this bill. Those offered in the Secure the Border Act of 2023, which recently passed the House. Congress continues to delay on getting solutions passed. Our country will continue to face immense immigration crises. This bill would, among other things, provide a path to citizenship for dreamers, individuals with temporary protected status, and undocumented immigrants, update the legal immigration process and provide the resources needed to secure our borders. Congress has an opportunity to make meaningful changes to key immigration-related policy. We understand the need to find immigration solutions at the border and in other key areas and urge Congress to work together to find a compromise and include it in any legislation that will pass in 2023. The U.S. Chamber of Commerce commends Representatives Salazar, Escobar, Gonzalez Colon, Shulton, Chavez Derimer, and Lawler for introducing the Dignity Act of 2023. This proposal contains the types of bipartisan solutions needed to secure our borders, fix our asylum system, and help American companies meet their workforce needs. We look forward to working with the bill's sponsors to get these desperately needed reforms to our nation's broken immigration system enacted into law. Our immigration system is deeply broken and congressional action is long overdue. That's why Salazar and Escobar for their leadership in introducing the Bipartisan Dignity Act. Their legislation is an important step forward as we work towards a more fair, humane, orderly, and legal immigration system. Look forward to working with my colleagues to introduce legislation in the Senate that can move us forward. The Dignity Act is a welcome bipartisan effort that differs from nearly all its failed predecessors' attempts. It is led by women who intimately understand the immigration issues and who understand how things get done. The bill is a thoughtful jumping-off point for serious, substantive negotiations. We're hopeful that bipartisan Senate buy-in follows shortly, adding to its promise. Salazar is taking a positive step toward achieving a workforce solution that agriculture needs. The bill includes provisions to increase access to the federal H-2A visa program and stabilize wages for Florida growers' changes that are desperately needed to ensure a stable, legal workforce for the industry.
More than 500 pages bill addresses many of the legislative principles outlined by the President's alliance at the beginning of the last Congress. This bipartisan approach would strengthen our economy and enable undocumented students, DACA recipients, and TPS holders to flourish as full participants and contributors to communities and our nation. The language closely mirrors the language of the Dream and Promise Act. The President's Alliance is fully committed to achieving a legislative solution for our Dreamers, who are integral members of our campuses and communities. Dignity, ACT Goodreads. Our immigration system is no longer just broken and messy. It's now dangerously dysfunctional, as Congress repeatedly proves the adage that if you aren't part of the solution, then you're part of the problem. Lawmakers may agree that immigration policy isn't working. But if they are truly serious about reform, then they should take a look at the Bipartisan Dignity Act of 2023. The Dignity Act currently being discussed in Congress is an opportunity for elected officials to come together and reform the mess they've made. The Dignity Act has bipartisan support. A representative from each party introduced the bill. They have added 10 co-sponsors equally split from each side of the aisle. The Act seeks to establish policies which secure our border while boosting legal immigration. It provides a path to citizenship for those individuals and families who entered illegally. It addresses the needs of employers dependent on migrant employees. The reality is the grueling situation at the southern border is producing a humanitarian crisis beyond comprehension. Images of children crying in cages separated from their parents, and human trafficking victims recounting their stories cannot be the first image the world has of the American dream. The Dignity Act is our best shot at working across party lines, to finally put an end to the madness of America's immigration system. The 500-page Dignity Act would allocate significant resources to strengthen border security. Create a 12-year pathway to citizenship at a $10,000 cost for undocumented residents. Revise and modernize the asylum process, address long-standing visa backlogs, and expand work visas, among other provisions. The Dignity Act is a sensible and Christian approach that upholds America's legacy as a beacon of refuge for those seeking a new life and opportunities. America will be the greatest and freest country in the world. Elected officials should realize this and embrace those seeking a better life for their families. By crafting policies that reflect America's empathic spirit, Salazar urge every member of Congress, senator, and official in the administration to support this morally necessary legislation. The combination of border security investments with new legal paths to earning citizenship will prove a policy success even if they will not make for an easy political win. Immigration policy hasn't seen major reform in decades. It's a field in clear need of an update that remembers the human side of immigration without minimizing the importance of the rule of law. The package of policies in the Dignity Act is a step toward a calmer border and a better system.